Hi and welcome to my episode 51 of my Hardcore Iron Man joint playthrough of RuneScape and OS and OS being um, tile and we've just hit 53 um, fletching from crafting some maple shell bows you now have all the levels you need for put in pie and need and both a stranger trap and demon high very nice now we're stringing the maple bows and that means 54 fletching mithril bolt mithril maple crossbow variants and maple stock it's definitely nice to get my fletching up a bit Okay guys, I'm going to be doing the quest in Pyre Need, accept quest. Yes, I will help. You'll help, but praise be God, I knew I could trust you from the moment I saw you. What is your name, Adventure? You can call me Lord Bugton. Well, Lord Bugton, it's nice to meet you. No doubt you have questions about the task around. What would you like to ask about the Phoenix? Can you tell me about the Phoenix? The Phoenix is an ancient creature, older than either of us can comprehend. It's a large, powerful avian creature surrounded by flames covered in a fiery plumage. It also has strong magical abilities. Every 500 years, it reaches the limits of its life and it returns to roots to complete the ritual and be reborn. You see, while not truly immortal, the phoenix can be reborn any number of times as long as it completes the rebirth ritual. But thanks to its wounds, the phoenix could be gone from this world forever. Thanks for your information. Now back to my other question. What would you like to ask about the ritual? The ritual is not complicated really. It requires certain ingredients and a set of dexterous hands. So we're running through these tunnels now, gathering these twigs from different trees. We have to get a total of five, I believe. And that's the fourth one. And we'll keep going. So I've saved the phoenix now. And now I need to go back to the guy, I think. Oh, where is he? There he is. Lord Buckton, I saw everything through a small vent in the roof of the phoenix roost. You have succeeded. Yes, I have. The phoenix is saved, and Lord Buckton, hero of nature, is not a bonus. I got to see it. My tears of watching were not in vain after all. Yes, I'm glad you watched my hard work from far, from a comfortable vantage point, Jack said the lair. Come now, Lord Buck, and it wasn't like that. The frail old man. What possible could I have done? I suppose you're right. Besides, the most important point is that the Phoenix is safe. Well, that reminds me, she also said to thank you for the shrine. And asked you when to return the trinkets. She knew it was about me. I should have known. Had I not been welcome in the lair, I would have ended up like the rest of them. I was full to think that my skill, it was my skill that kept me alive. And there we go, guys. Pioneer, in Pioneer completed 1 quest point, 14,400 fire making, 12,500 fletching, 11,556 crafting, access to the phoenix layer once per day, 5 phoenix quills, a chance to receive fever in the egg And there we are guys, 62 crafting, infernal urn, fire bat, staff and soul bowl, bell shoes and dame man. And now I have a repeatable daily I can do here now, which is fantastic. So now I'm actually fighting the phoenix this time, the second time through. This is like the daily thing you can do now, if you choose. And I thought I'd try it. You can instantly do it after the quest. There we go, I got him. And he goes to the middle. You light the pyre. And then he gets reborn again, I guess. Yes, and we get a bunch of XP. Sixteen thousand. Whoa, fifty-five fletching, maple shield bow, broadleaf bolts, and sephiri marrows and demon eye, and seventy-four fire making. One of the requirements for the fire maker's kit. Very nice, guys. Very very nice. Repeat. Okay, time for the smoking kills quest. Certainly, I can help. Great. All you need to do is jump down the well into the center of Ponytish and save my sister. Get to it. Okay. <laughs> deep in a tomb I've killed some zombies and skeletons and my cats helped me get through some traps uh oh now something's coming out of here it's a mummy warrior okay let's get him guys he's weak to water okay oh god wasn't very difficult okay I'm in the final boss fight this is really nasty this is harder than I anticipated. These guys are all going to attack me too. Just keep my health up. Good. 
Do they just go? Once more I am victorious and save the day. It's over now, burn in hell of your abject failure. You two have failed me. Spare me. My shackles, now freedom is mine. I'm rested to see my sister will deal with it. Wow. Now I'm really confused, yeah. A half-off thanks adventure with the death of the Banshee Mistress. My soul is free. Can you tell me what just happened though? You fought in an attempt on your life by the scourge of the desert land. The powers now will be less and less. Well, fortunately for you, you have a promise of reward, so you'll be safe from Avengers. As I only answer to your direct questions, I will too be to exist without atonement. Only she loses. That's a bit less confusing, but what a bit the book and the vanishing twin. The book granted my murderous powers over the creatures here. I am sure that his direction was simply to deny its powers. As for the sister, I'm sure you have realised that such a twin is far too convenient to actually exist. Now for my power to contact your own mind is fading as the immediacy of your victory passes. Once you have spoken to the Simona, I will await you below the well. Talk to me there if you have any more questions. There we are, smoking kills complete. Very nice. One quest point five for the Slayer. Increased Slayer points for completed Slayer task. Access to a new Slayer Master and Dungeon and Pollen if each Tomb of Catalogs. Ability to construct the binding Slayer items. Access to the Desert Slayer mini Dungeon Mini Quest. Okay, guys, time for the quest Desert Treasure. Now, this could be. This is an ad quest. Somewhat risky again. Like, but we're going to go for it. If we can't do it, then we'll just leave it for now if it seems like. But we're gonna try. Sure, I was heading that way. Any particular reason that far to excite you? Might... His name's Terry Blander. Give it to nobody but him. I'm sorry, I can't trust you with the actual tablet I find. It's far too valuable to give away. But at these actions, they should be enough to make a bloody translation on. Come back and let me know what he says. I would hate to waste my time excavating anything that is not worth my time as a world famous archaeologist. So, this is a huge quest, by the way. Huge. So, let's get to it. Oh, I just hit 50 constitution. Very nice, guys. Finally, another 50. I need to kill 100 things in this major. Like, I've deviated from the quest a minute because I want to try and do this. Where you... Where you, um, do 100 kills here or something. And there it is guys, level 68 magic, blood burst, cure rather, humidify requires dream mentor, dragon tip room, crossbow ball, ailstorm dagger and daemon knight requires 68 attack and level 5 enchant. We still haven't unlocked the 100 kill thing here yet without a food, but we're just going to push it to the very last second and teleport out. So, maybe we're close, see, and we, we can finish it or we'll have to see. And 51 constitution from this now too, crazy guy. Still trying to finish it though, I think. So back on Desert Treasure, we've entered this inn looking for the diamond. Indeed it is Rovat, but I can't find the incompetent fool. I'm assuming you are not the one who wishes to tell Lord Draken that his type has not been collected. I saw fit to take on the duty myself this time. Of course my lord, I mean no disrespect. So have you took the tithe ready for me? Of course my lord, I trust you'll find it all there and in good order. Hmm, well, for your sake, you're bad hope indeed it is. At the mood I'm in for having someone come to this wolf and says, but means any shortfall is coming from you directly. Then again, perhaps I was not a total waste of my time after all. You there? Me? Yes, you. You bear in. Suggest you are not one of the usual peasants, and you suggest you're one of those filthy wolf and folk. Come here, I would like to know what you're doing in these lands. Okay, so I got my first boss. Is he really? He's gonna meet me. Okay. He looks like he's using a mixture of stuff. What's that noise? It's going. S I think I'm better off using protection range. Because that's my weakest thing with this armor on, if you think about it. my first boss in this and then I'm gonna get the blood diamond and I have to bank it straight away really fast otherwise some this dude who can hit you for five thousand can spawn and kill you so I wanna take as many precautions as I can 
We got him. Let's put protect for me, Leon. Where's my diamond? Okay, so we got the blood diamond now. And we need we're heading into the snow region to get the ice diamond. Okie doke. Okay, I'm now fighting camel. Why am I having so much trouble hitting him? I feel like I'm being drained really bad. This guy's a pain in the ass. We're down eight magic, so we need to keep replenishing that every time we get low. Like I feel incapacitated all the time during this fight. Wait, why am I not wearing my lunar boots? Oh my gosh. During the actual fight, that's stupid. That is kind of stupid. Q. And I've already used three though. Got him. Nice. Very nice. So now we're past the boss and we're, we're going for climbing this steep icicle tower. Okay, now I'm fighting Fareed in the smoke dungeon. Okay, let's use that. Seems to be going pretty well. Let's just, let's just boost up my magic attack. I think that's the best idea. Try and really nuke him. That's the spells. Got it, guys. Get out of here, we got the smoke diamond, you have to bank them straight away. Otherwise you risk like this thing spawning. I don't know, it's me. So there we have it, the blood, the diamond and the smoke. One more to go. Okay, I'm now fighting Dama. For the final diamond. I want to keep spamming that spectrum though, don't I? Looks like there's a second phase. I defeated him and now he's turned into this second guy. And there it is guys, the shadow diamond. Let's bang, 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 bang. We got it banked. Excellent, excellent. And I made it through the desert. You have to keep running non-stop through this maze without falling. Three quest points, 20,000 magic, ancient magic, access to the bandits, camp home teleport, ability to bind will wield the ancient staff, access to the thrones and gravestone. That was a long and hard quest. If you go on that air, let know what happened to you. That was a long, hard quest. Guys, I've unlocked the desert, the bandit camp, lodestone. That's another lodestone for my collection bringing me super close to all the lodestone. Look, all I'm missing is Profandus, I really am. Okay, that's crazy guys, I've really, really done good on the lodestones. Just Profandus now. Fantastic. Hey guys, 81 farming from a worldy farming event. You may now raise some breed sigmites. That is crazy guys, um, my usual kind of loop. That is crazy. Hey, cooking some, upgrading my cakes to chocolate cakes right now. Why not? Still doing the chocolate cakes and there it is, 63 cooking. Bold bass potato and dame nine, stop burning tuna, stop burning mud pie and stop burning apple pie. Very, very nice guys from doing these chocolate cakes. Let's keep going, I'm trying to burn through them. Okay, so I took a quick detour into archeology span to restore some artifacts and wait, I sh why can't I restore that? Oh, 
Oh, I need two more insignias. And there it is, guys. 70, oops, missed the 70 archaeology. Absolutely amazing. Uh, I'm not possessed, pet. What the hell? From 5,000 rooms, girl as well. Wow, that is sick. Southern Lot Dig Site Storm Guard Citadel, Ecovian Memorial, Dragon King Remains requires Desperate Measures, Storm Guard Steel Wings of War, Necronium Matot, and Crystal Matot. Absolutely fantastic. I was just gathering the last bit of Cerosians to repair my last artifact. But that is huge. Another skillet in joining the 70 Club is huge. And just leveled up prayer, guys, from the Wilderness Event Lost Soul. And then I instantly entered the cash. I can't see where I've unlocked because of it cash, but very nice. So 57 prayer. So 57 prayer with sap defense requires quest the temple at Centerston. And we just leveled to 58 prayer. You have all the levels you need for Sandra's quest. Sap strength requires the temple at Centerston. And I've been doing these statues for the monthly. The monthly thing and I'm getting loads of construction too which is getting me towards 71 and we got one more statue to go at year nil so let's go to there okay this is the final one now there we go yes that's exactly what I wanted thanks for all your help there but we really put together a masterpiece didn't we no doubt the statue will need attention next month I still spray while we're here so the statue monthlies are done didn't quite make a level but Still absolutely incredible. And there it is guys, 68 fishing, access to the fishing guild and deep sea fishing hub, magnetic minnow rod fishing and green blub of jellyfish rod fishing from the monthly oyster event. And I feed them to the oyster, ready for my next month reward. And this is what I had for this month, not much good stuff. Oh guys, 71 construction. Wow, this is quite crazy. We've unlocked range in pedestals, marigolds, daffodils, picket fence, small fountain, tentacle pool, minor pit trap, icon of Bob the cat, mountain shacks, jaw. And this is from constructing my command center in my fort. I need this to do the next quest here. I would like to like get some more of this fort done, for sure. And this is one of the requirements, so let's whip it up, right guys? And there it is, the command center, all nice and built. Looks cool. Okay guys, now we're gonna do murder on the border quest. If the quest is from King Rold, it must be important. Indeed, the last I must warn you, the nature of this quest may be distressing. What is it? King Rold requests you also banquet for for free to commemorate your appointment as Duke. The royal family will be in attendance as well as select members of the nobility. This doesn't sound particularly distressing. Pardon me, of course, but have you met the other dukes and duchesses, the missful in nobility, or the queen for that matter? Why do we need to throw a dinner party for the king again? It's customary for all newly appointed nobles of your station to do so. Still, the political math of the nobility are not mad to be taken lightly. Be prepared for backstabbing, betrayal, and under deals, and for sarcastic jabs and passive aggressive remarks. So, for the quest, I have to build an actual building in the fort called the kitchen now, which is near the main hall. So, let's get cracking. And there it is, guys. The kitchen is built. Looks good. Ooh, a nice cooking, cooking range, and a bank, and a sink. Hey, hey. Oh wow, introducing King Rold from the Manosphere of Mistlin and Queen Alamaria. Oh look at him, more king guys, looks good. Duke, Lord Boogie. Introducing Duke, Colos, Lord Rodney Midas and Princess, more guests to the castle. Welcome to Fort Farinthia, Grace Eye. Yes, yes, I don't need to hear this spiel. Duke, Lord Bugger, I assume I'm certain you already know who I am. Actually, I don't. You don't know who I am? Well, you don't. I'm Cole Augustus Horse, Duke of Edgeville, and you would do well to remember that. Thank you for inviting us to this fine fort of yours, Duke Lord Bugton. Fine fort, it looks like wayward sneeze would topple it. This is what will protect us from the dangers beyond the wall. Edgeville alone faces incursions on a weekly basis. My people need need to serve far better. Um, I'm doing the best I can. With what resources I have at my disposal, I say you've done quite well for the for themselves, given out to King Tass this of them. 
Yeah, Alpha Sneer, you still know how to actually build this place. Watch yourself, Alba. Cole's one. Someone's been poisoned or something. Should I get him some water? I do believe he's dead. Lock down the fort now. Lock down the fort because the Duke choked on his dinner. This is madness. Look at the discoloration of skin. The way he acted. This wasn't a natural death. No, it wasn't. I know poisoning when I see it. Oh no, there's an assassin trying to kill Asta. We have to gear up for this fight. I'm not sure how difficult it is, but we we, we just got our rooster. I think it nearly would be fine. Okay, looks like we got this going. Nice. I heard an ear piercing scream and made my way out of the chapter and basket only find the foul beast running straight for me. If it hadn't been for Alice's timing and federation, I would have surely met the same fate as Paul Simon here. Oh great, Simon's dead too. Nothing's happening while you're here. Well, nothing. Simon deserved better than this. Such a lapse in security and becoming a new duke. Explain yourself. Was several of the king's guards on station at the north gate? They were your great. Once the beasts were in capacity, I arrived at the north gate to find the guards unconscious and the gates ajar. Oh. Eager to hear the result of your investigation, Duke Lord Bookerton. Let's review the evidence. Simon Satchel seems like an appropriate place to start. How did it end up in the courtyard? Why was the page torn out of the book? That does not align with what we uncovered. Simon claimed that when the king and queen threatening was attacked, he lost the satchel in the commotion. Oh. So we figured out Bianca was the murderer. Ask yourself, why'd you let these eyeborn scum lord over you? You're better than this. We're better than this. Better. You murdered two innocent people. The duke was yet another aggron and each born into power. He neither earned nor deserved. He cared not. He cared for the lives of his people more so than even his own. Not that you could understand your pathetic, selfish wretch. My big poor Simon, what did he do to deserve this? I didn't plan for the beast to kill him, he did deserve better, he was a friend. Uh. And there we have it guys. Murder, <laughs> murder on the board to complete one quest point. Construction XP lamp, X8000 construction XP requires level 40. Prismatic XP lamp, 3000 XP requires level 30. Ability to build all three tiers of the fort for every kitchen. And look, Rodney is now the chef of this place, I take it. What does he have? I don't have any surplus stuff. Oh, I need tier 2 to see him stuff. Well, let's get my lamp. Um, this is a perfect summoning situation lamp again. Nice. Okay, guys, we're doing Quiet Before the Storm Quorm, Swarm quest. That seems pretty unlikely, but it shouldn't take too long to verify. If that's the spirit. When you get back to the outpost, speak to Commodore Mafias. Report back to me here once you have found anything. Yes, sir. Oh, I'm doing some kind of puzzle where I have to cross certain people to get them across the bridge. Now I go back on my own. Um, just myself. You gotta get them all, you know, like the chicken kind of thing. Oh, I seem to be like we live in some kind of memory. I'm the Karasi fighting a pass. What the hell? Okay. Okay, quest complete. One quest point, 4,000 attack, 4,900 strength, point night seal, and 300 quest points. And that gives us 53 strength. Very nice. Huge though, guys. 300 quest points. So I'm going to instantly follow on with a follow on quest called Avoid Dance. Consider me at your service, Commodore. What's the plan? So if he tells me that the agents have been as a locating the escape path, as of the latest communication. Communique, he has recalled the majority of them to deal with an unknown malady effect of Falador. Does he believe they're connected? He wouldn't commit. Anyway, that leaves the problem in my hands and that's why I need you. I'd like you to take Captain Craftsy and Jessica to the mainland which are fully brief and put your tracking skills to the use. Okay then. Anyway, uh, I took a quick deviation from the quest to do the tree and I got 69 magic and unlocked Mooncrown Teleport. Nice. Let's quickly go through this opening sky. Nice. Uh, well, not nice. Well, whatever. So now we're doing like some clues. Um, 
related to the investigation. This quest is a very long one. A lot of steps. Password, this is urgent. Urgent or not, you're not getting in without the password. Get gone. I don't think I won't recognize you next time. You have a good memory for faces. So we're in some final room now. You killed the guard, okay. I have no love for void pests, but that was ghastly. Oh, the poor thing. I'm full of tubes and woe. You can talk? You can talk, and perhaps you understand him due to your skill in summoning. What does the mother say? Um, enough of this. Oh. I'm sorry, but I can't let you live to potentially harm others while it's deliberate or not. I expected so. Killing that creature must have been a difficult decision to but the light right one. It didn't deserve that. Come to the table want to know what happened here. Yeah, let's get back to the outpost. Anyone else thinks there's a lot of storage space for not very many queues? We passed through several large and mostly empty storms on our way in. So if we can deal with the rest in the place once we report in. And there we have it guys. Wow, avoid dance complete. One quest point, 10,000 hunter and air blow, nice. 8,000 summoning and wood cutting XP. 5,000 thieving construction and mining XP and 50 comedy. Nice rewards. I knew there'd be some level ups from that. 52 summoning. Spirit Terrible, Brad Death Slinger and Damon Heim range to unlock. And 58 thieving. You now have all the levels you need for Grim Tales. Another quest unlocked. Potential triple loop from Master Farmers Prize for you at Jersey. Every time I start reducing my quest list, another one gets unlocked. <laughs> so it always summing there. So a lot of these are mini weird mini quests that I don't know what to do with right now, but we'll probably Yep, that's fantastic. And there it is guys, 64 cookie. Big potato mushroom oil blue in pigs will require though. Bringing on bacon, stop burning rainbow fish, stop burning lobs, they're very nice. Okay, I'm back on OS, Anis, and you know what? I have 4086 rep, let's get a piece of the um, armor, right? Why not? What is that for? Quite 60 attack, colossal blade, design good? I don't know, but let's go with. Tunic, I guess. So there we go, guys. Our first piece of smithing outfit. Oh, look at that. Smashing, right, guy? Oh, look at me now. I'm a. Anyway, let's do another commission. Yes, please. Okay, guys, let's refer to the old bonus tile chair. Um, as you can see, we just recently unlocked this. Um, every achievement combat lock equals 10 points. Uh, so that's a bonus. It is. It still hasn't been 25. So we do get 10 extra tiles. So yep, there we go. Mm -hmm. So as you can see now, guys, we're at 137 tiles. So we're definitely picking our tile count back up nicely, which is great. And we're gonna do another sword with our lovely smithing breastplate. Yep. So how this tunic is supposed to work it's supposed to give me chance at increased progress and stuff so hopefully like make these swords slightly faster but I haven't noticed any difference yet but we'll have to keep going and see but it's, that's definitely what it's supposed to do though it's supposed to increase your speed basically of doing this I'm definitely being held back by the, like the quality of my materials. So I think I, I think that bag goes like up much further when you have like a bonus like tick. For example, right now I didn't need to do that much. But yeah, I'm definitely being held by my crappy material use. So, but you know, even though I'm becoming pretty advanced in my uh, you know other areas of the foundry, like unlocks and stuff. Crappy, crappy bass. Oh, that's a nice one. Let's get another commission. That was like a, a max, pretty much. I, there we go. I thought maybe now I was 61, maybe I would get some use the new type of um, curve for the swords. Uh, apparently, uh, 
it is possible yet still I've only done a few swords since then so we'll have to see I'm hoping I can get like a five can I exceed that like 10k mark for like gold for example and the 5k mark for, for money I don't know wait what am I doing I didn't pull the mold guys you might think oh you know these big tile bonuses are like a huge make a huge impact on my tile map yeah I have levels unlocked and stuff but the truth is only like 2,000 of those 500 5,382 tiles are unlocked through my own bonuses that I set which is absolutely brilliant I think you know it's like tile man with a few boosts it's, it, it's, it's not like I'm like really going out of control with it though or anything it's just like a few boosts so yeah literally only 2,000 of them are thank but, uh, you know other than the normal mod kind of set in though so yeah I'm just going to point that out Whoa, this is a really good one. Is this a new record? It might well be. Best completed at quality 68. You know what? I think it is. I don't think I've had 4980. I've had 4920. Or have I? But that is so close to my goal of 5000. Wow. Look at that, guys. That is a record wrecking sword. This this person who keeps talking and I I, I misclicked so many times. Uh, wow. Well. Oh well. <laughs> I just have to forget this sword happened, right guys? Yeah. It's going well guys, we're getting close to that big 70 now. It's gone really quiet here and this for a little while it was just me here for like a brief period. This guy's here now, it looks like he just completed the tutorial though, he was like hanging around there being weird. So that's what I assume he done, so yeah. And another amazing sword complete. No. Do you know why? There this guy's 70 smithing! Oh you can now smell adamantite ore and make adamant daggers and members can make crystal eye <laughs> helps and celestial signets. Oh my gosh! Wicked man, grats my lord, grats, grats. <laughs> very sick, very, very sick. 70 smithing guys, it now equals my woodcut in. Well, my woodcutting's a little above. See the sick though, absolutely sick. So once again, we're back to this screen and again, for the second time on this account, we are not the big one guys, the absolute big one. Um, down here, sorry, my bad, 70 a skill is 1,000 tile bonus. I think it's a great, I still think it's fair, it's like, like I said, I, I, most of my tiles are literally just from the normal, but I love to do these bonuses and I've earned myself a whopping bonus again. 70 in that skill. So there it is guys. So we're back at Al Karid trying to kill a few more guards, like mixing things up now. Need a bit of killing after all that smithing, right? They're all waiting to kill me from that. Oh these guys are always dropping nerf talismans, I swear. And there it is, 35 attack. You can't read on this game because it doesn't stay up on nowhere. But that is incredible from fighting these I'll carry worry. I've wasted a few tiles around here, but now nah, I'm just gonna take it though. Like I said, I'm not gonna be super strict about what tiles. That's all part of the fun and why I have bonuses and stuff. You know, I'm not doing like a strict. I'm just gonna unlock tiles casually as I feel like it. Hey, welcome to my recap for episode 51 of my hardcore Iron Man joint playthrough. Of RuneScape and Old School with Old School being tile. Anyway, XP change on RuneScape of 
375 up from 25 million 405,690 to 26 million 592,984. Nice. OS, a nice change this time of 73,621 up from 2 million and 45,743 to 2 million 119,364, bringing a total change of 1 million 260,996 up from 27 million 451,352 to 28 million 712,348. As for levels, RS, a change of 20, 1741 to 1761. And for OS, a change of 2, 629 to 631. Total change of both 22, 2370 to 2392. Quest points, RS, a change of 8 from 293 to 301. No change on OS, still still 9. Total change of 8, 302 to 310. Combat level, RS, change 12 from 82 to 94. No change on OS. 32 total combat change of 12 from 114 to 126. As for skills, divination still leading the charge massively at 93, which is absolutely sick, followed closely by mining at 87. Lowest skill now being um, ranged at 49. Wow, okay. And on OS, the lowest skill ranged hunter and herbal are all one, and the highest skill. Being woodcutting and smithing now, the joining at the top. Woodcutting has slightly more XP though, so it is still woodcutting technically. But smithing joining in at 70, which is absolutely crazy. Anyway, thanks guys. See you next time. Bye.